Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Coffee with Stephanie. I'm Stephanie, and I'm happy that you're here with me today to hang out and have some fun. So, I just found a parking spot. I am close to downtown. Um, it's a weekend. It's a gorgeous day. The sun is out shining, doing its thing. And there is an event going on, and I thought it'd be fun to do a YouTube video to film. I've never been. Um, it's the Uncommon event. They've held it for I think the past few years and they have different stuff set up um from what I can tell um they have like an axe throwing thing set up and miniature golf um set up you have to pay for of course <laughs> uh yeah and uh yeah there's just like a whole bunch of stuff and I'm pretty much here because um our bookstore has something coming out of the windows and I want to see that in person. I've seen it online, but I want to see it in, per in person. So uh, we will go check that out soon. That, that'll probably be our first stop. And while we're here out and about, we'll see what else is going on. The kids at home, they didn't want to come. Um, so but it's kind of nice to go to something like this by yourself and just take your time. And, you know, you don't hear a little voice saying, okay, I want to go home. I want to go home. <laughs> you know? Because that's what would would happen, and we can browse too if we want. I'm not planning on spending any money. I just want to, you know, have some free time and take my time, enjoy myself, look around, um, and yeah, have fun. <laughs> so let's go check everything out. Okay, so I can see our bookstore from here. <laughs> that looks really cool in person. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's cool. So it's a uh, Kraken. That's what's sticking out of the window. So it's so cool. Thank you. 
see Birdie? Let's go see this Birdie. Come on. You wanna go see this Birdie? That's so cool. <laughs> now that's a dragon. Wonder if he knows toothless. So I think I'm gonna to have to bring the boys down here just to see obviously the dragon and the owls they would for sure love that I didn't know that was going to be there <laughs> I'm trying to look for like um, an event list but I can't find one so I'll keep trying to look online I'm sure there is one uh, right now uh, I'm filming this on a Saturday so and I <laughs> filming two videos in one day because I did a coffee chat but that's easy for me to edit um, so I could take my time editing this one, but yeah, right now it's Saturday and <laughs> um, this is on all weekend, so it'll be going on tomorrow. So um, before we go to my mom and dad's, because it's my mom's birthday, um, yeah, we're going over there to celebrate with family. I will, um, before we go there, we can stop here and help I find a parking spot. I think like right after lunchtime, 12, 1 o'clock is a good time to come. I like, it's busy, but I think later on in the afternoon it's gonna be busier, so a little bit easier to find a parking spot. So yeah, I'll have to bring them down here tomorrow and make a pit stop before we go to Nana's and Papa's. Yeah, just to check out a couple things. And there's also like a teacup race, and there's people like dressed up as steampunk characters and uh, there's wizards walking around, so that's really fun. Now, being the Uncommon Festival, there's for sure there may be things that I don't agree with, but that's okay. It's no different than any other day, you know, because there's a lot in the world I don't agree with being a Christian. Um, but you just um, look past those things and, yeah. <laughs> you check out the big, huge dragon. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't spit out fire. <laughs> It's a beautiful day for a walk by the lake. There goes the ferry. <laughs> well, that was a pretty.
Now this is brand new. Oh, it has numbers on it. Okay. Let's find number one. I've seen this posted online, but haven't checked it out yet. Beautiful. Okay, pause to read if you want. So, I just did something, something came over me, kind of like shaking. <laughs> so I know coming into this, there would be a chance of seeing tarot cards or a psychic reader. Well, I guess they're both the same thing. I don't agree with tarot cards. And I stopped and she was going to give me a high five. I'm like, okay. And I told her, these are evil. They're of the devil. If you keep going down this path, it's not going to be good. You're going to end up not where you want to end up. And I say, Jesus loves you. And she just kept going, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, but, you know, she kept trying to, and I understand. She kept trying to just dismiss me. I understand, okay? Nobody wants to hear, some, or some people don't want to hear Jesus talk. But when I say something like that, and I feel compelled, you know what? I, 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 how can I call myself a Christian if I don't stop at a place like that and just tell them, you know, even though they may know it, but just tell them and remind them, like, okay, this isn't bad. You're letting, you're opening up a door for evil to come in. You're on the wrong path, but Jesus loves you. <laughs> yeah, okay. I feel good, but I was shaken after because I, I, I've never done that, but it was just, it was coming out of my mouth, and you know, it's like, even though she dismissed me, and whew, okay. it felt good though, you know? I mean, tarot cards are, are evil, I do not believe in them, and they are of our horned friend, and uh, yeah. But that's what I mean, I knew coming into this, but it's just like any other day going out in public, you know, seeing something like that. You know, you just, everybody has their own choices. You know, rather they know if it's right or wrong, we all have our own choices and our own beliefs. And you know, that's okay, it's a free world, it's a free country. Um, not really free country, but, <laughs> but, um, Nothing is really ever free, but you do have your own free opinion and you do have your own free choice, you know, and if you choose to daddle and that, that's up to, you know, to each their own, it's up to everybody, but I just feel good because, you know, I'm against that and I will speak what's on my heart and maybe I was meant to, maybe, you know, that's why I felt like coming here and even though I knew, so yeah, okay. Ooh, shaky legs, but hey, that felt good. Yeah, that's right. Because uh, that is, yeah, yeah, that's bad stuff that you do not want to get into. And yeah, Jesus does love you. Thank you. 
happy. It's the worst one that I would feel like I would ever let myself do. Super hard, and I don't think I'd want that tall. No, no, I don't think I would. Because when you can't be the edges to start with, and then you have two sides, and you, the color is the same. Ones, yeah, no, that's, that is more than I'm burning for. Yeah, that's what I would All right, so I made it back to the car. I took a quick look into our bookstore. Just a quick peek. Didn't really see anything. Um, and it was getting, getting kind of busy when I was just about to leave. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to head home, but that was definitely um, an adventure. <laughs> I was only out for about an hour. I did do a lot of walking, but I'm a fast walker when I don't have kids with me and if the kids were with me they would definitely be complaining and i wouldn't have gone you know be well i wouldn't be able to have gone walking by the river you know slash lake it's really a lake but sometimes i call it call it a river um <laughs> so yeah so I, I, if they were with me i wouldn't would not have been able to do that and um another reason why i was shaking when i talked to the tarot card reader is because that is really unlike me okay I am not like that. I am not a person that will go up to a perfect stranger and start the conversation, okay? I am not sociable, okay? I don't like to socialize with people I don't know, but hubby does. A hubby can talk to a complete stranger and start a conversation and be talking to them for like hours. And me, it's like, yeah, I, I don't want to talk to anybody. So that is really unlike me, but I don't know, something came over me, and those are the words that came out of my mouth, and maybe she needed to hear them, and maybe that's why I was meant to be there, and I didn't think of it at the time, but I remember having a dream, I don't know, like maybe a year or two ago, that I went to the Uncommon Festival, or like something like that, I'm not sure if it was the Uncommon Festival, but in my dream, it was like that, and I went to the Navy Yard, and there was... Um, a psychic set up but by the park house so different location <laughs> and I I pretty much in my dream say like pretty much the same thing you know if you keep going down this path it's not going to be good but you know it's up to you to each their own um but <laughs> you know and she did say that she did love Jesus um and that she like she knew that but uh, it's like but if you do love Jesus you wouldn't be doing the tarot cards because tarot cards they're just yeah they're bad <laughs> okay <laughs> but you know I just you know it felt good you know um because like we we are you know like his disciples and if the opportunity comes yeah I, I, absolutely I, I will talk about Jesus and tell them you know Jesus loves you you know he died on the cross for our sins right so yeah yeah <laughs> Oh, but you know, that's it. I say my piece and that's it. The rest is up to you. I'm not going to be pushy. You know, it's up to you. You know, we all have our different beliefs and thoughts. So, yeah, <laughs> but that's so unlike me. <laughs> oh, but it felt good. It felt good. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, that's why my legs were shaking also because it's like that is so unlike me. I never do that. <laughs> and I bet she gets people, you know, that's why she was like being dismissive of me, trying to get rid of me. She probably does get a lot of people. But I stood my ground and said what I wanted to say. Let me finish and then I will leave. Don't dismiss me in the middle of me talking. I will leave when I say what I have to say. Okay? Okay. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah so anyways i'm gonna head home um i'm not sure if i'll come again with the boys um probably not i don't think like i don't know if it's like really worth coming to find parking just to see the dragon for like two seconds you know and the owls that would be the only thing for them um to see so i think i will just skip that they're not really missing that much and so and um i not sure if I will, you know, come again, you know, yeah, yeah, but I was just, I was curious, I wanted to see what it was about, and I, my reason for coming, even though I knew there, there would be bad stuff, but like I said, we face this kind of stuff in our everyday lives, you know, I could come across a tarot reader, you know, who knows, at Walmart, you don't, like, you know, you don't know, um, you know, there, there's, like, it doesn't matter, um, even at, like, other festivals, like, you know, that we have around town, you never know, somebody might have a table set up, you just, you don't know, and you just, you know, there's stuff that you like, and there's stuff that you're going to come across that you don't like, so, 
um, yeah, not just at festivals, but in everyday life. So, so like, I knew that going in, um, but I only came, I want to see the cranking, the a crack can, um, oh, coming out of the library, because that was cool. Not library, sorry, bookstore. Close enough, they both have books. <laughs> but that was really cool, and yeah, that was just neat to see. So, yeah, um, okay, I saw it. If I do come again, it would probably just be, like, um, just that, just the owls, you know, oh, and they have, um, a busker station set up, that would be cool to see, too, um, but I'm assuming that happens at night time, probably, like, around dinner time, so, because it goes on till 10 o'clock, I believe, so, you know, that would, that would be cool to see, but, you know, that's okay, if I don't, you know, if you don't see it, it's not the end of the world, you're not missing out on anything special, so, yeah. Anyways, okay, all right, that's it for this video. I hope everyone enjoyed it. Those owls were really super cool, really beautiful, beautiful creatures. Um, when they look at you <laughs> with those big eyes, it just, I, I think they're like eyeing you, uh, you know, up and down, like, oh, you look tasty, you know, and their eyes are huge and they mean business, <laughs> you know, but I'm sure they're really, really nice and really sweet and uh, yeah, they were really, really cool. Yeah. All right, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Take care. Be blessed. And as always, ta-ta for now. Bye.